Wow, what's up everybody? Once again, it's Brand Man Sean, and today I got to talk about why Lil Pump and Lil Yachty are the next Batman and Superman. Now, if you go through Lil Pump's Instagram, you'll notice something. A lot of times, he's a relatively normal guy. He might be dressed a little different, but he's a pretty normal guy. But then he puts on the costume, and next thing you know, he's entertaining the world, and he even flies. And the same goes for Lil Yachty as he navigates the rap world, entertaining people so he can get Batmobile after Batmobile after Batmobile. These guys are characters, and if you really think about the Instagram feed and the way it's formatted, it's almost like a modern day comic book. And you get many stories either through a picture or video, sometimes it's a full collection or it's just a single photo that tells the story itself. And especially in hip hop where fans are obsessed with these larger than life characters and even the origin story that's found for every character in comic books. Think about Cardi B, people are obsessed with her story and the rise from being a stripper in the strip club all the way up to where she is now that rise from normal person to gaining her superpowers that's just like any old superhero a lot of artists now like Diddy Jay-Z so many artists have their own clothing brands they've attached their name to products like practical products one day Lil Pump might have a water gun named Lil Pump one day Yachty might have a little boat line. And you gotta realize that it's easy to take your name and use it to sell these everyday regular products, but we're talking about superheroes here. Lil Pump takes time off from Harvard to save us from a world of boredom. These guys have next level brands that are on par with any superhero. I'm talking about Spider-Man, Batman, Flash. This is true intellectual property. The comic books were dead until they started doing these movies and the theme parks in the 2000s. That very same thing will be the opportunity that a lot of these artists have in the future. That means instead of just using their brands to sell products, they can use it to extend into other creative stuff. Think about Andre 3000 with the Class of 3000 TV show. That cartoon right there, that was amazing. And you know who else has a superhero level brand? The Migos. You can't tell me that they wouldn't have a dope cartoon. More of these artists could have legit video games, not just some quick app. Think about Michael Jackson's off the wall video game. Who remembers that? Speed it. You better run, you better do what you can. Don't wanna see no blood, don't be a macho man. That junk was so hard. Somebody else has to do another video game that's a real action video game. I would love to see an artist do that. Snoop Dogg seems to be the only person who's really taking that persona and pushing it to the limit. I mean, he has a unique voice, he has a unique swag, even his own unique lingo. For shizzle dizzle. The point is, artists with such unique, strong brands, they are legitimate superheroes. We really consume them and take in their stories and we can push and build around them just like any kind of theme park, cartoons, movies. They can go anywhere and I would love to see more of it. I want to know who you guys want to see in terms of having a theme park, a video game, like make some recommendations, like some real recommendations of what the cartoon would be, who the artist would be, and what it would be about, or the name of the video game they would have or should have. Other than that, if you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you like it, you might as well share it. And if you're not subscribed, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button.